What's up, Peak Timers? Welcome to this week's edition of Hot Wheels News. We've got a ton of new 2020 releases, including mainlines, super treasure hunts, 2025 packs, and car cultures. Let's get started. If you don't already follow me on Facebook, make sure you go head on over to Facebook and give my page a like. All my newest videos are gonna be posted there first, including this one that you're watching right now. It was posted a day earlier on Facebook. Also, don't forget to follow our growing community on Discord. I'll link it in the description box below. First up, we've got a very exclusive first look and video from granatoys.com on the 2020 Hot Wheels D-Case. Let's check it out. So we just received the newest D-Case from Mattel today. And I'm gonna open this and just display some of the cars that are inside. There is the black Bugatti that everybody's gonna be crazy about. Bunch of repeats with the, another Alpine, a Diora, another Mustang, Cloak and Dagger, nothing new for this year. New Aston Martin with some repeats. More Volvos, darts, Jeeps that are old. Bunch of repeat from last case. New Tankinator. A new Mustang. Some buns of steel. Some other new. There's a new Civic in black and red. A new Street Stealth. Nobody likes motorcycles. A new Integra. A really funky looking Mustang. New Porsche Spider. Some repeats. On to the second part of the case, a manga tuner. Somebody's gonna be interested in that. A Mazda Repu, somebody will be interested in that. Another Santa Hauler, which is a repeat. Another Alpine, a Moto Wing no one cares about. Another black Porsche, and a Speed Driver. That looks new. Another manga tuner, nerve hammer, a raptor. That's pretty cool looking. Oh, Moon Eyes Beetle Pickup. That'll be hot. Another total disposal. Everybody seemed to like those. Batwing, those were good. Rip Rod, Black. Uh, surf and Turf, another Santa Sled, another just a bunch of repeats, and another Bugatti. So this case had two Bugattis in it. Thank you very much, Darren at Granite Toys, for that early look of the 2020 Hot Wheels D case. As soon as I receive my case, we'll have a full video on it as well. And check out this picture, guys. This is actually my picture. I found a Hot Wheels 9 pack with the brand new black colored Bugatti Chiron in it. Next up, we've got a bunch of new 2020 Hot Wheels main lines. Our first one is the 91 GMC Cyclone from the Hot Wheels Hot Truck series, Honda S2000 from Honda series, Bone Shaker from the Hot Wheels Dream Garage, 2013 Hot Wheels Chevy Camaro Special Edition from the Hot Wheels Dream Garage, Cloak and Dragger from the X Racers, Aston Martin Vulcan which will be a Target Red Edition exclusive car, RV There Yet from Tuned, Skate Grom from the Olympic 2020 Tokyo series, a new color of the Volvo 8 50 estate from the Hot Wheels Race Day series, a cool looking color for the new Volkswagen Beetle, and a new recolor of the Corvette C3 with that really blown big engine on it. And recently there was the Japan Hot Wheels convention which had a bunch of new mainlines and car cultures released. Let's have a look starting with the 98 Subaru Impreza 22B STI, the 2017 Nissan GTR R35, 2018 Honda Civic Type R, Nissan Silvia S13, 1988 Honda CRX, 
Corax Loco Motorin 2017 Nissan GTR R35 1998 Honda Prelude Mattel Dream Mobile and a really cool looking Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles Party Wagon 2016 Bugatti Chiron Zamac Edition and I've got some exclusive pictures of it as seen right here. This is the actual production variation of it so you will be seeing it in stores very soon. 1989 Porsche 944 Turbo Honda S2000 Datsun 510 Wagon Momo Edition 1964 Chevy Nova Gasser 1969 Ford Mustang Boss 302 1990 Acura NSX and the Honda Monkey Z50 The complete line of 2020 Hot Wheels 5 packs have hit stores. Let's have a look at them. First up we've got the Hot Wheels Fun Park, Hot Wheels Hot Trucks, Fast and Furious, Wave Cravers, Hot Wheels Exotics, which includes that McLaren F1 I'm really looking forward to, and the Hot Wheels Flames, then the X Racers, Car Meet, the Track Builder 5 Pack, Police Pursuit, Hot Wheels City 5 Pack, and the Night Burners 5 Pack. And here's a look at the 2020 Matchbox 5 Packs Matchbox Countryside, Matchbox Highway, Matchbox to the Rescue, Matchbox Service Crew, and Matchbox Wild. The Japan Convention also announced a bunch of 2020 Hot Wheels car cultures. Let's go over them. We got a Fast and Furious set, which includes a Ford F-150 SVT Lightning, Buick Grand National, 1961 Chevy Impala, 1972 Ford Grand Torino Sport, and a 1966 Chevy Nova. Next is a Door Slammers car culture series which will be released in January 2020. It includes the 1971 Porsche 911, the 1971 Datsun 510, Alfa Romeo Giulia Sprint GTA, BMW 2002, 1970 Ford Escort RS 1600. And then we got a Car Culture All-Terrain set which is released in May of 2020, the Land Rover 110 panel, Porsche 959, Ford Bronco 4x4, 1967 Chevy Camaro Off-Road, and a 1988 Mercedes Unimog. Next up is a Car Culture Hill Climb set which is released in July of 2020. It will include the Ford R200, Volkswagen IDR, Lancia 037, 1984 Audi Sport Quattro, and the Porsche 934.5. Then we've got the Modern Classics car culture set with an unknown release date. It includes the Subaru WRX STI 22B, Mercedes 280, Volkswagen Jetta MK3, Nissan Silvia S14, and the Honda Civic Hatchback EG. Next up is the Power Trip Car Culture set which includes the GMC Cyclone, Buick Grand National GNX, Custom 1972 Chevy Love, 2018 Dodge Challenger SRT Demon and the 1965 Corvette C2. We also have these carded pictures of the Japan Historics number no. 3 set which will be released in February of 2020. It includes the Datsun Sunny B121, the Mazda Cosmo Sport, 1985 Honda City Turbo 2, 1982 Nissan Skyline R30, and the Nissan Silvia CPS 311. We also got a look at some new Team Transport, including the 2016 Ford GT race car and Ford C800, and a Volkswagen Beetle which looks to be on a T1 pickup truck. I'm not sure if this is actually a Team Transport or not, we'll have to see. And if you're a Hot Wheels ID fan, here Here's an exclusive look at the BMW i8 Roadster Hot Wheels ID Edition. The detail in this car is fantastic. I really can't wait to see this one up close in person. Let me know down below, do you guys collect Hot Wheels ID cars? Here's an interesting story out of Germany. Here you can see a bunch of Hot Wheels cars which have actually been opened up and put a security tag inside of the blue.
blister pack. Apparently Hot Wheels at this store are stolen so much that they have to actually open them up and put that security tag in so it makes it harder for thieves to steal these cars. What do you guys think? How will this affect the collectability of Hot Wheels by them already being opened up? Let me know down below. With all these really cool upcoming releases, it really got me thinking, which cars do you want to see come back or be released to Hot Wheels? Do you want to see a new Koenigsegg, a new Lamborghini, or perhaps the comeback of Ferrari? I'd love to see a lot of really new cars. I feel like we need more exotics, more sports cars, and maybe some new SUVs. Let me know in the comments down below which car you're perhaps looking forward to in 2020 or even 2021. You are now up to date in this week's Hot Wheels news. Make sure you smash that thumbs up and I will catch you guys on the next one. Bye bye.